Hey guys, welcome back to the Griffin and RM YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Getting ourselves back into our two-minute technicals video looking at XRP. And, as we can see, got a sharp, sharp decline right from that 100-day moving average uh, actually here on the 4-hour getting stuck and getting wedged underneath that 20-day. So easy to set that sharp, sharp decline. And as you know, we were kind of talking about this um, just on Tuesday, Monday, and Tuesday of getting a sharp re, uh, you know, retest up to that region of 66. Right there. And we would think over some possibilities of getting an overextension if we were able to actually get ourselves to close above 66. But as we can see, we lost some steam. We had indecisive candle here and then an immediate rejection back downwards. Got down to 62. Remember, I was telling you guys, you know, I, I was looking if we have fell through 63.7 we're going to be seeing around that 62 region we got the 62.19 uh nope so nice so anyone who's able to get that short got some nice little movement out of their crypto that is nice to see but what's going on now so as you can see you know we were going over one scenario of us doing this to this double w pattern like it could do something more like that but what i would expect if it were to do a w pattern would be for us this neander back downwards do this neander back down to do this and neander back down here to that 60 region and then you know get get through this uh 67 region and actually it comes around that same region over here of that 70 and flies up where our ceiling is but what we're going to use right now for some sort of um what would you call it some sort of um gauge maybe so maybe maybe sort of like this they're using the top of these candles just like that could use that and you see it comes to around august 14th yeah something like that so we might build a neander in this region but if you want to go very very short term you could use this go like this very very short term this would actually be decided by tomorrow by end of day so tomorrow end the day you can see how this works out if we're able to get that pump and get ourselves exploding through that 20 day moving average you're going to be exploding up there to the top of the region makes sense uh ain't that funny how that works uh around there to the 65 uh 3 to 66 cent region or you're going to wind up getting a retest right back down here to this region right here that 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 61 and a half but obviously if it were to come back down here to that 62 61 and a half region it's coming down to 61 uh exactly which is that 1618 obviously we get that 1618 target uh, revisited again i i would expect a 59 to 57 cent xrp at that point because you throw this on an inverse here come here invert the scale you can see exactly how that is if you if we were to real quick uh let me get rid of these ones real quick so you guys can understand what i'm saying um you grab this high here you grab this low you can see that that went up there to that 1618 lost it obviously but okay what we're gonna do is use this high right here we're gonna use that low and you can see exactly where we are so we flew up came back down for support and we're at a kind of weird zone right now. We're going to come here and get between the 618 and that uh, 0 0.5. And if we're able to crack through here, get to that 786 and actually break the conviction, it's going to that 56. Obviously, not, not for you guys, obviously, but I, what I'm saying is just that the, in, my, in my eyes, it's obvious um, just how it's playing. Uh, obviously, uh, I'm not trying to be that guy, but it seems like we you know we're just doing relief rallies this is what we we're talking about earlier in the week we're just keep doing the relief rally fall the reef so you get that same kind of movement you get the hold itself fall relief fall and then if you were to grab that do the same thing over here you can actually grab it if we can grab this pattern you can see the same thing look at that it's almost pretty much exactly the same you get the relief condense fall and then that would play perfectly in that a 58 cents to 56 cent region and that would be consolidate us right above our previous breakout zone of that 56 to 50 uh eight seven zone i don't know what are your thoughts i mean that's that's what my thoughts are uh, it makes sense this, uh, here in the rsi as well coming flying coming from the top going to the bottom coming up here to the 786 getting rejected and coming back down it just it makes sense get some push to the downside and just continue onwards you can see it takes a little bit of time for it to move on but that's just the way it is 
No, that's a good song. Is, is that 90s or is that early 2000s? What song? Can someone name that song in the comments? I forget what that is. It literally might be the name of it. <laughs> but I hope you guys are having a good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. Remember, all this short-term stuff. But, you know, we have our long-term vision on what XRP is. Obviously, you guys don't need to partake in that daily stuff. But you guys know what my thoughts are on that. Have a great one. Have a good Friday. And I'll see you guys soon.